channel, it's Kristen. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing another Allure boxing. So this is July's Allure box. Allure box, let's see. With passion and purpose, every dream is possible. Huda Katan of Huda, Huda Beauty. So Huda Beauty is a, she used to, she, well, I don't know, she probably is still a YouTuber. I know that she's a beauty influencer, which is just awesome. I love it when people who start out, you know, just talking to the camera, like me, are come so far. It's just, it's really inspiring and really cool to see. The only thing I've ever tried from Huda Beauty is their, um, their eyeshadow. I have one of the Obsessions eyeshadows, but I know, I know that they have a million really nice eyeshadows. So we're going to get into it. Um, we have kind of a hot pink bag this time. So that's cool. Um, and then we have a lipstick that everybody got. So the box. Thank you. I like that. Okay. Hopefully I didn't just show my address. I'll cut that out if I did. Okay. So first I wanted to, this isn't really going to be a try on because there's some makeup items in here. I am going to put on the lip color, even though the lip color isn't really my thing, but I'm going to put it on anyway, but we'll see how I look with it. Okay, so like I said, it's a hot pink little bag today, and then I'm going to pull out everything that comes in it. Ooh, actually I could probably use this right now. Um, so this was just in my hand, so we'll do this. This is a 20, an Urban Decay 24 hour slide on, slide on pencil in zero, so it's just their black. This is their classic black. It's a matte black. It's very creamy, very rich. You guys know how I feel about um, Urban Decay eyeliners. I like them. I like the Sephora ones better. I will still use this. Um, I usually use them on my upper and like on my lower lash line. They don't really last in my waterline, but I do like them. And this is a very, very good pencil and a very good color. I don't know why I'm waiting to be around like that, <laughs> but it's a very good pencil. Look how black it is. It's amazing. Perversion is a little bit blacker, but zero is a good one too. I'm going to put it over here in my vanity because I'm going to use it. Um, this next thing I could probably use because my hair is like a mess. This is a Way Hair Care Texturizing Spray. So, like dry shampoo and hairspray had a baby. <laughs> well, let's try it. My dog's right here, so let's try not to scare her. Oh, no, scared the crap out of her. Oh, that's a strong smell. Oh, that definitely gave some some lift to the hair, didn't it? I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry. I scared the crap out of my Molly. Uh, okay. Oh, I need to dye my roots. But look at that. Yes. Now my hair doesn't look as boring and flat, huh, baby? You want some in your hair? I didn't think so. <laughs> but there we go. Okay. That was cool. It's It's got too strong of a smell, though. I'm probably going to regret that and probably going to have to wash that out. But I, uh... Okay, all right. Well, it definitely did something here. That's cool. Definitely gave my hair a little bit more volume and a little bit more texture. So that was nice. Scared the crap out of my dog. That wasn't nice. <laughs> all right. So, yeah. I don't know what it smells like. It smells, it smells like perfume, which... <sighs> okay, so then speaking of perfume, they also gave a perfume sample of Kate... Kali, 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 Vanilla 28. So it's just a little tiny perfume sample. And Vanilla 28 is Vanilla Orchid, Tonka Absolute, Brown Sugar, Amber Woods, and Musk, which sounds amazing. Vanilla and like woodsy and amber are my favorite kind of smells, but yeah, that's probably going to go in a giveaway. So, but it smells really, really good. I like that. Okay. Um, the next thing is, before I get to the two actual Huda Beauty products that are in here, um, this is cool. This is, oh, I've actually always wanted to try one of these. Is there only one in here? It looks like there's only one in here, but that's okay. Okay, so there's only one in here, but that's okay, because that will give me, you know, something to do. Okay, so this is the Tony Mo... Tony Moly, Tony Moly Intensive Care Gold 24 Carat Snail Hydrogel Mask. So I've heard of these. 
I've seen people put them on their face. They're gold. It's just a face mask. But, and the Tony, Tony Moly. Oh, my cat wants it now. Hey, hey, I'll be out in a minute. Uh, the Tony Moly is like a really good brand so for skincare so this is cool I, I'm really excited to try this it feels like a really like thick mask so it feels like it folds and the mask is in here that's cool so then the two Huda Beauty um, items we got ooh, that's a thick band are her eyelashes these are in the style Samantha which are a very classic style from Huda Beauty that is a very thick band and some very wispy lashes. Those are really, really long. Um, I need to get back into wearing my false lashes, but it's going to be a while before I'm going to be using this pair. Maybe I'll do a full glam look one day and use these pair. These pair? These eyelashes. They're pretty, though. They're pretty. Like I said, they're a very classic style from Huda Beauty. So that was cool. I, I could try her brand without paying for them. And then also everybody got an alluring, a Huda Beauty alluring um, liquid matte lipstick. The packaging is divine. Look at that. That is divine. And then it just, it slides open and you have your lipstick, which is a, it's more orange than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like a true red. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. No, it's got kind of an orange like an orange, maybe I'm, uh, maybe it's just being deceiving. Hmm, smells good. Smells like cake. Hmm. Okay, so let's try the lip color. This definitely needed a lip liner. Look how messy it got. Yes, it's much more orange than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be more of a true red. Not that it's like really orange, but it's got like a tint of orange to it. I look horrible. Look at this. I tried a new foundation today. Not a big fan of it. Okay, so it's drying down pretty much instantly and I can tell it's going to be a drying formula. Um, I don't like the color on me. I really don't. I, I don't. I'm not a fan of this orange tone it's got going on. Hmm. But that's what it looks like. Um. So, you know what? Yeah. Um. So again, we got the lipstick, which honestly, I'm probably not gonna wear very often, if at all. I probably should have swatched it on my hand so I can give it away. Um. Yeah. Not really my color, but it's. Pretty. I really thought it was going to be more of a true red. But, you know what? Thank you. Thank you, Allura and Huda Beauty. Like I said, the Samantha lashes are a little, like, woo! Definitely um, going to try them at some point. I don't know when, but I'm going to try them. And because I've always wanted to try Huda lashes, so this is, you know, not free. It's $15 a month, but that's a good way to try them. Super duper 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 excited about this. I'm super excited about this. I'm gonna totally give this a shot. And if I love it, I don't know. I, I how much are the how much are the snail masks? Golden snail masks, huh? Um Oh, it's ten dollars for one mask. Okay, well. Okay. One mask is ten dollars. That no, that's pretty expensive. It's pretty expensive, but We'll see how well it works. The texturizing spray, I like the life it brought to my hair. The, the smell, again, is completely overwhelming and smells like I've sprayed perfume, which isn't good. Um, when you have somebody who has allergies to smells in the house, this was really, really strong, and I wish I would just kind of like sniffed it before I did it, but I like the way my hair looks, so that's cool. I like that. And Way is an amazing brand. And then, like I said, this will go in a giveaway as like a freebie kind of thing. Mm, smells good, but yeah. So with my Allure, I, this is my, I, got, I started it in January, so this is my seventh Allure box. I have to say that I enjoy it. Um, sometimes, uh, I used to get like Etsy and Birch, Birch, 
Burke box. I don't know what it is. And uh, like the Sephora play box. And I would just get bored of the mini samples of it. And I would get repeats a lot. I haven't, I haven't gotten any repeats in seven months. And it's a good mixture of skincare and of, it's a really good mixture of skincare, hair care, and makeup. And I'm really, really impressed by it. Um, so I, I will continue to get the Allure boxes. I hope that you guys like the unboxing because I like unboxing it on camera as well. Um, yeah, it, you get things that you wouldn't normally try because like, I wouldn't have tried this lipstick. Mm -mm. I wanted to try this, but I just couldn't justify getting it. I think deep down I knew that it was gonna be expensive for one mask, so I'm glad I get to try it and probably get addicted to it and probably love it and have to buy more. Um, same thing with this. I've always wanted to try her lashes and Samantha is like I said a really classic style So I'm really excited to, to uh, get these way hair care is awesome. So it never hurts I'm, I haven't really found anything that I'm just like oh, I wish I hadn't got that in my box So I may not use everything, but I think it's a really good value for what you get. So that's it for me today. I hope that you enjoyed this unboxing of my July Allure box. If you do, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I update. Thanks for watching.